Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're looking at a common problem. You try to open an MP4 on Windows, and it just won't play. Sometimes you get an error, sometimes you just hear audio without video. Why does this happen? Well, MP4 is just a container. Inside, the video could be encoded in many different ways. If Windows Media Player doesn't support that codec, the file won't play. Another reason could be missing codecs on your system, but don't worry, let's go through a few easy fixes. First, try using a better media player. Windows Media Player is limited in what it can handle, but free players like VLC Media Player support almost every video and audio format. VLC is open source, lightweight, and works on Windows, Mac, and even mobile. To use it, go to videoland.org and download VLC. After installation, right-click your MP4 file, choose Open with VLC Media Player. Your video should now play without problems. Second, you can convert the file into a Windows-friendly format. For this, I recommend HD Video Converter Factory Pro. It's an easy-to-use video converter that supports over 500 formats and devices, so you don't have to worry about compatibility. To do this, I open the program's converter module and click Add Files to load your MP4. I on the right, choose Output Format and pick WMV or H.264, which work well in Windows Media Player. Click Run to start conversion. Once it's done, you can play the converted file smoothly in Windows Media Player. Third, install a codec pack. A codec is basically a translator that helps your computer read different video and audio formats. Without the right codec, Media Player can't play the file. The K-Lite codec pack is one of the most popular options. It's free and adds support for many video formats. To install it, a search for K-Lite codec pack standard and download it from the official website. Follow the installer instructions, then restart your computer. After that, try playing your MP4 again in Windows Media Player. And one more note, if your MP4 file is actually corrupted, these methods won't work. In that case, you'll need a dedicated repair tool to fix the file itself. So to sum up, try a better player, convert the file, or install codec packs. And if the file is damaged, use a repair program. If you found this useful, don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more quick tech solutions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.